Hi everyone, it's Angie the Craft NATO. How is everyone doing today? I hope you are doing well. I am doing fine and dandy. Um, here today with an, an or, with an order from my friends at Everyday eCrafts. Uh, asked me if I'd like to pick out some more products to show to you, and here they are. They came lickety split. Um, they are very fast with their shipping over there. Uh, I usually get it within 10 to 14 days of ordering, which coming from all the way overseas is pretty pretty good shipping time, I'd say. So let's get right into it and not waste all of your day because I'm sure you're busy and you have tons of stuff to do. So the first one that we have is a full drill diamond painting and um, comes with just your standard toolkit with what you need to diamond paint, a pen, a boat, and a plate of wax. Every diamond painting kit you ever get will have that in it if you're new to diamond painting, so don't worry about ever not having enough. This is a, the canvas is not real, real um, stiff, but it's a stiffer canvas. So let me just roll it backwards and see if I can get it to lie flat for you. I'm sure you guys have already seen who it is. It's getting to be that time. It's that time of year to start getting ready, you guys. There he is, the big guy himself. So I know that I've told you all the story before that my dad is a Santa's helper. And um, so Santa is an image that's very near and dear to my heart. And I saw this image and it is just a, such a good rendering of a good classic Santa Claus, isn't it? I think it is just, uh, for a budget diamond painting, it's like an amazing rendering, I think. Um, it's picture printed, so you're gonna have that detail behind, that's gonna show through from behind your drills, cause it is a round drill, 30 by 40. 24 colors, all letters for the code, and you do have your DMCs in both legends on the left and the right. And the drill field is very clear. You got light symbols on dark backgrounds, dark on light, just the way you like it. Um, and it is not complete color blocking in this background. So your background is not gonna be all one color. There's a lot of uh, color changes in there. If I can just close up. Well, you can't really tell because my camera won't focus. Sorry about that. But there is a lot of um, color variation in the background. And it's interesting because I'm looking at the table and there are there's no 310 in this picture. So I'm anxious to see what drills we're gonna be using for the background. Looks like some 939 navy blue and some 823 navy blue. So we're gonna get, the background is actually gonna be navy blue, which is fine. I think that'll look nice. Sometimes I like that better than, than having, you know, just black or just white if they have, a, have something different there. So that'll be nice. And putting that 939 and 823 together like that is going to give it kind of a variating variation of depth kind of look. That will be nice. So for drills, we've got white, of course. That's Well, it's not 5200 white. It's 3865 white. Um, so, and then some uh, tans that are going to be probably for his face. Some varying degrees of tan. Then we have some gray, blue, a country blue, a mauvey lavender, a lavender lavender, dark brown, light pink, navy blue, a lighter blue, burgundy, dark green, dark blue, bright Christmas red, peach, mustard, Forest green, Christmas tree green, brick color, gray, and plum. I wonder where that plum color is going to go. That's interesting. Maybe here in the, oh, probably here in, his, in the dark parts of his, the shoulder of his suit. 
to give it, you know, the look of some depth. So that'll be nice. I think that this is going to be a nice little painting. This will make a nice little gift for somebody if you needed something to give, um, you know, it would be a nice little gift. I would like to receive that. I don't think I will give it as a gift. I think I'm going to do it and put it up in my house at Christmas because that is a, this one is definitely a winner. Definitely. I like Everyday E-Crafts. They have a lot of, uh, they have a good selection of items and I've never had a problem with anything I've ordered from them. All right, we're just gonna set that big guy off to the side there and reach in and grab another. Let's see what else I got. I might have all full drills for you today. That'll be something, huh? If I had all full drill diamond paintings for a change instead of special drills. I like to mix it up though when I make an order. I like to get some of each. I like to I, I like to work on special drills quite often late at night when I can't sleep and um, don't feel like concentrating on a full drill. So I like to keep them. Um, I like to keep keep my stock up of my special drills. So I've always got something to work on. I keep a I keep a couple behind, hidden behind my recliner out in the front room. So if I'm ever having some insomnia, I can just reach back and grab them and work on them real quick because I don't kit those up. All right, the next one is a full drill. This toolkit does come with some baggies. So if you're a baggie lover, you've got some baggies in there. This is a really nice canvas um, that is on this one. It's, a, it's not super soft, but it's very supple and it's going to lay out very nicely. And this is one that I've been so excited to get. I have not seen this on any other site. Um, let me know, I mean, I guess it doesn't matter because I already have it, but I haven't seen it on any other site. And I saw this and I knew immediately that I had to have it. It is Starry Night, but, and, and what diamond painter hasn't done Starry Night? That's like a diamond painter that hasn't done a peacock diamond painting, right? I mean, everybody in their, in their repertoire should have done Starry Night. They should have done a peacock and they should have done a sunflower of some sort. Um, oh, did I test the sticky on that Santa? I don't think I did. I'll pull him back out and test it before we go. I'll do it right now, actually, before we get too far. Very sticky. Santa is incredibly sticky. Don't have to worry about that adhesive at all, which is good because I hate not sticky. So look at, I, I just almost flattened that just by pulling the cover back and replacing it. And I'll probably do it again because I didn't do a very good job right here. I've still got a crease in my cover. But this canvas is so nice and supple that it's going to lay flat almost immediately. But have you ever seen something so cute as this? Seriously. I mean, come on. It's a starry night. It was a Christmas tree. Come on. Tell me that isn't the coolest. And it is picture printed, so you have the definition that's going to show through behind the lines. So you're going to get the swirling effect of the clouds like you want to and of the line of the um, horizon. Very cool. And of the branches on the tree, you'll be able to, you know, kind of get the effect of the, of the, of the swirling lines. It has 24 colors. Um, it is 30 by 40. And the key is all letters, and the drill field looks very clear. Did I test the sticky on this one? I don't think I did. This one is also very, very sticky. So nothing to worry about with stick on that. And I love this. This is two now that are just complete hits that I'm so excited to work on. They're so cute. They're very cute. All right, so the drills for this one. The drills are pre-bagged. Imagine that. Fancy that. So not only did you get baggies in your toolkit, but also your drills come pre-bagged. That doesn't happen very often with these budget-friendly kits, so that's really nice. Um, I know a lot of people like to work out of baggies. You know that I don't. I hate it. I'll still kit it up, but a lot of people do. So, so you have a lot of this really nice blue... I don't know what color blue it is. We'll just call it really nice blue. Oh, actually, is the is this one that has the DMC on it? I think it is, 792. Is that right? 
No, can't be. It's a number eight. 798. So I did, yeah. So the DMC code is also on the baggies. So that's nice to know. Some white, more blue, a nice Kelly green, light blue, little bit of uh, brick. Ooh, that's a very pretty color. What color is that? 3849. I don't even know how to describe it. Kind of a turquoise, but kind of a muted turquoise. Light blue, blue, you know, starry night, guys. It's going to be blue. Turquoise. The lighting seems weird in my room. I'm filming at night. I normally don't film at night. So I'm sorry if the lighting is a little off. I'll try to hold these in a little bit better way. Uh, light blue, mint, more light blue, more of a, like a dusty blue, more blue, few greens, nice greens, some tan, some yellow, couple, few more blues and another yellow. And that is the 24 colors that make up the Starry Night Christmas tree. You guys, oh, I've got to do this one. I am going to be, um, tonight is Friday night, September 24th. I am going to be doing um, a pop-up live in just a couple of hours. Maddie's coming home and we're going to have a pop-up live. So maybe I'll post this video right now. And if you happen to see it and you want to come to our live, um, at 1130 Eastern time, we're going to do that. And I think that I am going to work on this diamond painting um, because I can. That's why. Um, because it's nice and going to be nice and flat already. And because, uh, yeah, because it'd be fun to work on something small and, and, and different. So keep an eye out for that. Or watch it on the replay. Which is just as fun, I think, sometimes. Although sometimes it isn't, because then, you you know, if you want to interact, you can't. Yes, this is the order of, of all full drills. You guys lucked out. I don't know if you like that better. Do you like it better when I show partial drill kits or when I show full drill kits? That's an interesting question. I would literally, I would like to know the answer to that. What do you prefer? Do you prefer partial drill kits or full drill kits? Let me know in the comments. And then I'll know what to focus on when I'm trying to choose because believe it or not, when I, I, you know, I do order things that I like, but I also try to think about what other people might like when I'm placing these orders. So let me know um, if there's something that you, if there's one that you prefer over the other. And I will maybe tailor my choices based on the input that I get. Okay, another Santa. 25, you can see what kind of mood I was in the day I placed this order. 25 by 25 centimeters, so really cute size, um, not a lot of drilling. 19 colors though, that's quite a bit of colors, um, but we do have several symbols in the key, which is not a big deal. Um, it is picture printed, but it's just a little bit harder to see that because of the symbols that they chose to use. Um, no, it is not picture printed. It is pixel. Yep, it is pixel printed. But it's weird. It's pixel printed in a way, in a rounded way. In other words, the um, it's almost like it's made up of um, guide, not guide circles, but guide shadows. And they're rounded. It's like pixeled, but rounded. So you don't have the sharp corners. You're, you're seeing the nice round you know, corner or curve of his hat. So that's nice. It's This is really, in the um, canvas is a nice supple canvas. Uh, it's really nice for a small one. Very, very sticky um, canvas. It still gives you two keys, even though it's so small. So that's nice. Standard tool kit. And lots of drills. This is a heavy sack of drills for how teeny this diamond painting is but that's okay nothing wrong with having extras is there nothing wrong with having some extras Whew. so 
so the most color that we have is this color here. And I'm thinking that this is probably 3756, which is that very light mint green, which is interesting because that means that's what's going to be his beard and hat. So that's really interesting that it's not white. I might change that. I might change that and pull out some extra 3865 white and change the change that to white because I'm not sure how much I like that, that that's that mint color. Then we have a very light lavender. That's just going to be for the shading under his mustache and under his um, hat brim. Some dark brown, dark green, poop brown, red, Christmas red, um, some peach, some more red, more green, more brown, gray, 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 mustard, like a dark mustard, brick, light gray, black, because your whole background's going to be black, so there's quite a bit of those, pink, and mauve. So, just the colors you would expect that would be in it um, and a few extra for shading to make sure that the image um, is going to have some definition. So I think that for a 25 by 25 with 19 colors, I think that's going to come out really well. I, um, I like it. I like it a lot. Boy, I've gotten some good, good stuff today. I'm excited about this order. All right, last but certainly not least. This looks like a bigger one, so I'm not sure what I did here. Let's see, I might have did a thing. Feels pretty big, feels pretty big. Now this one is just a standard stiffer oil cloth canvas, or oil can, you know what I mean. Eco, whatever, not eco canvas, standard oil canvas. And it is a big guy. So I'm just going to roll it backwards here and see if we can get it to flatten out. This toolkit also does come with some baggies. All right, let's see what I got this time. Oh my gosh, I forgot about this. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh my God, I love it. Don't you love it? Isn't that gorgeous? I am so happy that I got this. You know, I wavered on this one because I just, I wasn't sure. Um, I wasn't sure if the detail was going to show through, but it's a 40 by 50 or 50 by 40 because it's landscape and the detail is there. It is definitely there and it has 24 colors, which isn't a ton, but I think it's enough. Um, we have all letters of the alphabet for our key. That makes it easy as heck. It is picture printed, so you're going to see those nice um, lines and a little bit more definition. Um, and it is very confetti heavy, uh, but very pretty. I love this, you guys. I'm totally, I'm in love with this diamond painting, and I don't know why. There's just something about it that is um, very cool. Very, very cool. All right, let's take a look at these drills. So you do have two keys, one on each side, which is nice with it being a little bit bigger of a diamond painting. And we are gonna have some bright colors in this puppy. Ooh, these, oh, this, you guys, I love this. All right, we've got some green, brownish green, some tan, blue, Two big packs of this gorgeous purple. This is a really pretty purple. Let's see what number it is. Four. 550. Of course it is. Uh, some cream. Bright yellow. That's just like a really bold bright yellow. Another yellow. A more mustardy yellow. Two bags of deep blue. A royal blue. A brick color. More dark blue. Some um, teal, a very uh, bright light blue, moss green, another blue, a dusty blue, and a gray. I was going to say, that's not enough, <laughs> but I've got another strip. 
country blue, a butter yellow, a mustard, dark mustard, a lavender, and a purple, and another bright blue. That is going to be so pretty. Look at those colors that are going to go into this. It's going to be such a like cool mixture of fall warm colors and bright, cool purples and blues. I think that the combination of those is just going to just pop on that canvas. That is just going to look amazing. I am looking forward to working on this one. Very cool. Very nice canvas. Um, let's test the stickiness. Now let that be the death of me that it won't be sticky, but it is very sticky. So that is good. Thank goodness for that. Because this is going to go definitely on the top of my list of things that I'd like to work on because I really love it. Really like it a lot. So I want to say thank you to Everyday E-Crafts for sending me these things to show you. And like I said, let me know, you know, what you prefer seeing. Um, do you like round or full drill paintings or do you like to see the partials? Do you like a mixture of both? What do you guys like to see? Um, if you have any other questions, you can leave them down in the comment section. I'll get back with you as soon as I can. I will link all of these items in the description field tab of the video. Uh, so if you are interested in any of these, you can just go there and find the link. And I will see you guys all in my next video. And I hope you all have a great weekend. And maybe I'll see you later on tonight. Um, that'd be great. All right, guys. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.